Kia ora, Sandra Gray, the National Secretary of Toho Tu Kaurangi, the Tertiary Education Union. Well, it seems we're going to be on the move again and um, it seemed a great time to check in with you all. But first, I just want to address the members from Tamaki Makaura. Thanks for continuing to act in union to stop the spread of the Delta variant of COVID-19. We are grateful for all you are doing. But we do know that for many of you, the continuation of the level four response is really tough. So please reach out um, and seek some help from your union friends across Aotearoa um, and a friendly ear um, to explain what's going on for you. We are all here to afi each other. So pick up the phone, send us an email, or contact us on our social media channels and let us know how things are going and ask for help. As well as the level four response, of course, uh, Auckland is also dealing uh, with the pain caused by last week's terror attack in West Auckland. We struggle to find the right words in the face of terror attacks, but we do want to turn at this time to our Tikuiki Tiriti, which sets out a path for us as a union um, to walk every day. As Martin Luther King once said, Darkness cannot drive out darkness, only light can do that. Hate cannot drive out hate, only love can do that. And our whāinga in Te Kōikitiriti are our light. We stand together, tu kotahi, tu kaha. We afi each other and seek help when we need it. We work to make sure that every member has a place to stand and can endure through the highs and lows, nā piki, nā hiki. And we work in shared ways, um, finding shared ways forward, tato, tato e. So in uh, the rest of the country, for the rest of Aotearoa, what's up? Well, in level two, tertiary education organisations make their own decisions about whether to return to campuses and what they'll require to ensure people can return to campus safely with regard to size of gatherings and things like the wearing of masks. Before anyone returns to work, however, we absolutely want to see health and safety plans designed and put in place. And we want workers to be involved in setting up those health and safety plans. I mean, the health advice is clear. You need small gatherings, you need good ventilation, you need to make sure people wear masks when they can't physically distance, and you need to make sure everybody checks in with the COVID tracer app when we move outside our own homes. So as a union, we'll be checking in to make sure health and safety reps are consulted on what plans will be put in place for the return under level two, and we'll make sure you all know about what the latest actions are. So in the meantime, again, if you need to reach out from anywhere in Aotearoa, email, phone, send us messages via social media and seek some clarity on what's happening around the return to work. Our whainga are daily actions. So afiatu, afi mai, Take care of each other and look after yourselves.